Let x be triangular with parameters 0, 2, and 4. Use Apple to compute the following. So the first is find the expected value of the absolute value of x minus 3. And in this particular case, that will come out to be the expected value of the absolute value of the random variable x minus 3 will be the integral from minus infinity to infinity of the absolute value of x minus 3 times f of x dx. Now of course you want to work this integral between 0 and 2 and again from 2 to 4 and perhaps to get rid of this absolute value you might have to also break it around 3 as well. So you might have a number of integrals to work out. But as you'll see, I'll put a dot dot here dot because we're going to do this in Apple in a few minutes. The answer here is 13 twelfths. More details on that a bit later. So for part B, if X is the lifetime of a personal computer in years, let me go ahead and draw a picture of what that might look like. Here is time zero, here is two years, and here is four years. And so the triangular distribution is going to look just like this. Well, if that's the lifetime of a computer, and that is a very approximate lifetime, of course, they don't just cut off at four years. Some of those personal computers just keep on hanging on. But the idea here is find the expected remaining lifetime of a personal computer that is three years old. Here is the probability density function. That's what we have drawn here. But if a personal computer has made it to three years, then it has a conditional distribution Remember, we've got to move this up so that it will integrate to 1. It has a conditional distribution that looks like this, and we want that mean of that conditional distribution. So at this point, we're going to go to Apple and try to work these problems. The first thing to do is enter maple, and that is done with the command There it is, maple. And then you want to read in the Apple software, and that's with the read command. There is a back quote, Apple, and then another back quote. And these all, of course, end with a semicolon. And that will read in Apple. And then what you want to do is define a random variable x to be a triangular random variable with parameters 0, 2, and 4. And you'll notice that in this particular case, the probability density function breaks at 0, 2, and 4. We have a continuous random variable. And the probability density function right here is 1 fourth x between 0 and 2. And then it's 1 minus 1 fourth x between 2 and 4. So that defines the triangular random variable. And then when we want the expected value, there is a routine called expected value. And that routine says use x as your random variable. But instead of getting the expected value of x, you would get that just by typing the mean of x. You want the absolute value of x minus 3. That's the particular expected value that you want. And that comes back with 13 twelves, again saving um, a few steps of integration. Now the second part says that the personal computer is three years old and you want the remaining lifetime. So I'm going to define a new random variable called w here and use the truncate function to say truncate that random ver variable x so on the left at three and on the right at four. And now we have a new random variable. Notice its support right here is between three and four and its probability density function is 8 minus 2x. Finally, the last thing we want is we want the mean of w. And since we want the expected remaining life, we put in a 3 here, subtract out 3, 
And what this says is that personal computer will have one third of a year left on its lifetime. So finally, the expected remaining lifetime of a computer that has been um, used for three years and is still operating is one third. So that is the solution to part B.